everyone my name is pradul and welcome or welcome back to my channel so i'm here at the airport and i think this is going to be like my first like travel proper travel for 2022 um let me actually show you what my view looks like because it's so pretty this is what i'm seeing currently Okay, so where am I going? I'm going to Udaipur now. I have been to Udaipur, but I was really young. Like I remember absolutely nothing about it. Um, let me actually tell you how this trip came about. So I think about like 15, 20 days ago, um, Aditya and I were just searching flights, like literally flights of like random places. And Udaipur ki flight was so inexpensive. It was for like 5,300 rupees to and fro, which is pretty cheap. And we were like, you know what, let's just go to Udaipur because the tickets are really cheap. We asked every one unfortunately no one is free during the time we, we were free so it's just the two of us on this trip what's up guys <laughs> so it's early in the morning and we're waiting to board we're done with everything so yeah let's get started with today's vlog <laughs> We just landed and we didn't have any idea how to get to but obviously we didn't know anything. So inside the taxi, they quoted us 1200. 1500. 1500. Then there was 850 and now finally 650. So I think good, it's a little bit but 25 kilometers is good, right? Because our hotel is like 40 minutes away. So I'm very excited to check out our hotel because it's so beautiful. So yeah, let's go. Let's go. So we're staying in Jagat Nivas and to go to Jagat Nivas, you like the cab doesn't go all the way till the hotel. There's a specific point where it's gonna stop, and then we have to take a rickshaw from there. Um, the temperature is actually really good. It's like 21 degrees Celsius, which is very pleasant, and for like Mumbai guys like us, it's great. But uh, like my cousin also visited Udaipur the last week. She told me that it's really hot, and um, that's what it seems. The Perko is gonna be really hot, but then in the afternoon, sorry, in the morning and in the night. Gonna be nice and cool, so I'm hoping that it's not too hot in the afternoon because Mumbai is already it's super hot. So I can only imagine ki like Rajasthan mein kitni garmi Okay, so we boarded our rickshaw, and I love rickshaws. Fun fact, so I'm very happy about this. I think it's gonna take us 10 more minutes to reach, and uh, I don't know what the plan for today is. We'll figure it out. Um, so we've asked for like an early check-in also. Let's see if that's gonna happen. Usually check-in is at like two o'clock. It's like only 11 at this point. No, it's actually 12. So maybe we should be able to get early check-in. Okay, so made it to the hotel and uh, we've checked in also. We got an early check-in thankfully, but I have to say I'm beyond impressed by this hotel. It's a boutique hotel and it's so beautiful. It was already really pretty online, but in reality, it's just stunning. Like there are so many corners, like every single corner is beautiful. It's unique and it's very aesthetic. I love it so far. The room also I love. It's very clean, very um, like royal. And the bathroom is not super fancy, but it's very clean. So I like that. Let's actually quickly do a room tour. So now we're actually just exploring the hotel um, and probably we're gonna have lunch here only.
So exploration is done of the hotel. Actually, partially we just got hungry in the middle. So we've sat here in this beautiful spot with a beautiful view, um, and we've called for some food. Aditya is working on the website, um, and he was just telling me that we are going to work on this. But at least we get to work. with this beautiful view and also this hotel is so peaceful i don't know i'm like so like impressed and so in love with this place already it's been like how many hours like 3 hours since i'm in udaipur and i love it this is like my second goa like i love goa i'm obsessed with goa i feel like this is like my next like favorite place this is what our dinner looks like i've ordered some dal makhani which is like my absolute favorite and then what is it called aditya the thing that you ordered मुर्ग मलाई टिक्का ही इज ऑल अ स्टार्टर बिकॉज ये पूरा मेरे से खत्म नहीं होने वाला है एंड देन वी जस्ट हैव सम लाइक मॉकटेल्स बट या दिस इज वॉट वेर हैविंग ओके लंच इज डन हाउ इज द लंच रियली गुड रियली गुड इट इज वेरी गुड और डिजर्ट वॉज ऑल्सो रियली गुड आज आई वॉज सेंग वी टू कर ओन स्वीट टाइम वी हैड आर लंच आराम से आई थिंक वी वॉज सिटिंग दर फॉर लाइक वन एंड हाफ आवर्स just chilling and now we're just deciding what to do next but we're definitely getting out of the hotel even though i don't want to at all okay so quick outfit change i'm going to have like multiple outfit changes other says obviously just wearing the same thing so um game plan so we're going to do some street shopping abhi then we're going to go to jagdish temple and then we're going to go to lake pichola hotel for dinner um and sunset so that's the plan for now also these earrings they look cute but they're killing me i'm probably going to take them off i'm going to take a few pictures actually let me show you what my outfit looks like i'm wearing one of uh, like a ski on product also you can't see me but this is unreal can you guys see that it literally feels like i'm in a fairy tale like no exaggeration so i'm wearing a new denim skirt this one looks like from the back it also has like a slit and lots of pockets my phone also fits in here easily i can fit my camera also in here which is very really handy and i'm wearing this really cute like fun top orange earrings and then this top also came with like a band so i just like tied it here as like a scarf and yeah that's basically it. the jagdish temple right now the reason why we are here is first of all it's really famous and like literally every place that i read like things to do in udaipur ye tha hi tha aur dusra cheez ye hai ki i wanted to go to siddhi vinayak and uh, i couldn't because siddhi vinayak mein slot book karna padta hai and mujhe sirf koi ganpati ke temple mein jana tha to ye temple mein bhi hai ganpati uh, ganpati bappa and it's so beautiful it's hand um, carved and it's just mind blowing how beautiful it is i personally would totally recommend you to come here it doesn't matter if you're religious or not i feel like mandirs temples just have like the best vibes and it just feels so like calming relaxing and uplifting almost do you agree yes totally definitely we're totally. literally sitting on the floor yeah mandir ke floor pe just admiring the beauty i don't know Too how pretty. how people back then used to be able to carve such like intricate designs it's mind blowing it's a must it's a must visit yeah, to udaipur i agree even if it's just for like 10 minutes so ek bar chakkar maar lo just look at it and you can just leave एट द लेक पिचोला होटल राइट नाउ एंड ऊपरे रेस्टोरेंट में विच वॉज वेरी पॉपुलर मैंने बहुत जगह पर सुना था एंड इट्स सो प्रिटी इट्स सो ब्यूटिफुल कैमरा इज नॉट डूइंग जस्टिस आई फ्लिप द कैमरा एंड शो यू वट इट लुक्स लाइक इट्स सो ब्यूटिफुल बट वी डिड इंडल्ज इन अ लिटिल बीट ऑफ स्ट्रीट शॉपिंग एंड देर आर टू प्लेसेज दैट वर अमेजिंग द फर्स्ट वन वॉज विनायक हैंडीक्राफ्ट दे हैड सच ब्यूटिफुल दे लिटरली हैव एवरी थिंग एंड इट्स सो प्रिटी एवरी थिंग इज हैंड मेड आई लिंक दैम डाउन बिलो एंड द गाय I, um, I think his name was Deepak. He was so sweet. In fact, actually, all the people here are so sweet and so kind. And then the second place is called Shriji Emporium. He had beautiful jewelry like earrings and uh, necklaces and rings and bracelets, literally everything. Again, such a sweet guy. Um, two places I totally recommend. So anyway, अभी हम लोग आए हैं Lake Pichola Hotel में मुझे रुकना था यहाँ पे actually Lake Pichola में but uh, there wasn't like availability when we were trying to book. But obviously, in the grand scheme of things, everything just worked. Worked out um, because I love the hotel that we're staying in, and I'm really sad that we're staying there only for two days. Um, but anyways, um, we've ordered some coffee and French fries. The view, so gorgeous. 
Tell everyone what's happening. I don't think the camera caught it. Bullet. It's going to rain. Yeah, it's thundering. It's thundering. And Adi hates the rain, by the way. I've come to Rajasthan. I mean, Rajasthan. It's, it's raining. <laughs> I mean, I love the rain, so but I'm not rain mad. Rain follows me everywhere. Yeah, it's because <laughs> it's also gotten really cloudy. And um, our plans were to rooftop on rooftop and sit dinner on the rooftop, but. I don't think successful होने वाला है इतना I mean camera पे blue लग रहा है sky but it's grey so भाग के हम आ गए हैं हमारे hotel फिर से which is जगत निवास and it has a beautiful rooftop actually we was we was saving this place for tomorrow and we wanted to dine at Lake Pichola but अगर वहाँ बारिश होने लग गई तो we'll be stuck I mean stuck as in we can come back but I don't know. It's just an added hassle. So we're just gonna come here in case it rains. We can go down. There's another restaurant um, indoors, so we can sit there. But currently, the sky is so pretty. Let me try and show you. The sky is so beautiful. It's pink and orange, and oh my god! Guess what? It's raining. It was bound to happen, to be honest. It's pretty. I just feel like it's gonna get. Cooler, which is a good thing. Aditya is really enjoying the weather. <laughs> I hate rain. I hate the rain. Too bad. Too bad. <laughs> We're back to our OG spot. We have some like sing um, with like a salad sort of a thing, and this is where we're sitting. And that's our room right there. So we're literally just across the hall. This is where we were sitting for lunch as well. Okay, so I'm back in the room after like three hours, um, and instead of like having a meal or having a conversation for three hours, we were fixing bugs in the website, and um, it was quite a fail. But then I think we like figured it out in the end. So it's okay. I'm just gonna call it a night because कल रात को भी I slept for like four hours. So I'm gonna sleep tomorrow morning. Wake up early, hopefully, and start. A day early, start the day early, and um, explore lots and lots of Udaipur. Good morning from Udaipur. Today's day two, um, and we're just having some breakfast. So there's a buffet, like an included breakfast in our hotel, and there's also like live music, which is so calming. I think you guys can hear that in the background. Let me show you what our breakfast looks like. I feel like it's pretty good. What do you think about the breakfast spread? It's good. Spread. It's good. It's decent. What well, my breakfast looks like. What is what Aditya's breakfast looks like? Always falls apart. Yeah, but it's still less today because I'm not that hungry. Yeah, he usually has like a full plate. Today it's a little less, and also, oh my God, check out the view. So pretty. The cups are also so aesthetic. I'm just having some black coffee, and look at the tiles. Oh my God, literally everything about this place. is magic so we were supposed to leave at 10 o'clock sharp to go to city palace because i've heard that city palace gets really crowded as the day goes on and it opens up at 9:30 so i just thought it would be a nice idea to leave as soon as possible and reach there as soon as possible but this place is just so it just makes me want to just like relax like people like us like people i feel like in general who come from like mumbai or like really fast cities have a habit of being like go 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 you know but yahan pe aake i just feel like just sitting and doing nothing like literally sitting in nothingness and just looking out because like literally everywhere you look it's so beautiful the instrument that the guy was playing which is called a santur was just so relaxing and calming it's I have like literally no words. I feel like everyone should come to Udaipur for sure. I feel like it's very underrated. So finally we've left after one hour. So we took pictures. Then we took a few uh, reels. reels. Then shorts. Yeah. YouTube Content video. Creating, YouTube video तो चल ही रहा था. और कुछ एक और चीज. Vlog. वही. मतलब बहुत कुछ चल रहा था side by side. So as I was saying, we're done with everything. Now we're just gonna go and walk to city palace. Basically, Udaipur. Me, you can walk everywhere. You can take a rickshaw if you want, but I don't think it's real. Someone like me who hates walking is still able to walk because the weather's really pleasant and the gullies are very beautiful. So yeah, I would recommend walking. Made it to city palace and got our tickets. Three hundred rupees. Kia, one ticket.
basically everything has like little um, like notes and descriptions written so you can totally read it but uh, tour guide was for like 200 or 300 rupees right yeah 300 rupees so you can totally get one if you want city palace done it is definitely a very like touristy spot and it's very crowded but i think it's a one time thing for sure it's very pretty from the inside ek bar ke liye acha i feel like if i were to visit udaipur again for the second time i wouldn't come to the city palace would you no maybe not. most probably not i think it's just like a one time thing but i think worth seeing for once at least back at jagat nivas change karne aaye the aur fir change aur washroom ke liye aaye the actually the location of our hotel is so perfect it's very really close to almost everything and it's walking distance so now we're just going to go have some lunch at this uh, cafe which is called wheels cafe bahut kuch suna hai uske bare mein aur abhi bhook bhi lag rahi hai so we're going to walk there obviously um and i'll show you what we order So we are done with our lunch. We had lunch at Jeel's Cafe, yeah. which is a big thumbs up from our end. Uh, super nice place, good food. Uh, cost was also it was yeah. I think good. And the view was also nice. Yeah, very nice. So would definitely recommend. What sort of? अरे सबसे important Jeel Cafe से बाहर आने के बाद केक कट किया लोगों ने ये कैसे होते पता नहीं. So there's lots of like cow dung everywhere. So थोड़ा नीचे देख के चलो. Not like me. डायरेक्ट एक कैमरा ऊपर है और हमारे पैर नीचे डायरेक्टली काउडंग में ओके सो बैक टू द होटल सो नाउ वी आर गोइंग टू स्विम बिकॉज दोपहर का टाइम है इट्स टू हॉट टू डू एनीथिंग आउटसाइड सो वी थॉट इंस्टेड ऑफ जस्ट सिटिंग वी शुड यूज द पूल बिकॉज कल तो वी आर चेकिंग आउट फ्रॉम दिस होटल सो वे गिन गो स्विम जस्ट फॉर लाइक हाफ एन आवर प्रॉबेबली एंड देन वी लीव बिकॉज वी हैव अनदर लोकेशन टू कवर आउटफिट नंबर थ्री फॉर द डे आई जिस कैरी सो मेनी आउटफिट्स हम लाइक माइट इज वेल एंड हमारा होटल इज लाइक लिटरली इन द मिडल ऑफ एवरी वेयर तो हम लोग सुसु करने यहाँ पे आ जाते हैं और शॉपिंग गॉट फॉर माई मॉम सो एम वेरिंग दैट विद द झुमकास दैट आई गॉट फ्रॉम Udaipur and then this bag so pretty so yeah that's my outfit the outfit is the same as today morning <laughs> In fact, the pants are the same as yesterday only. <laughs> On our way to the ropeway, costed us two hundred rupees. Uh, one way, of course. Slight change of plans. We're at Lake Pichula. Um, we've come here for one day instead of going to ropeway. We would ropeway also. So we are in our boat, and uh, we've opted for the what is it called? Private, Private luxury boat. It's called. <laughs> it's called two six what four zero. 2640 but you can also take the regular boat where 30 people sit in the boat and uh, it's 165 rupees so obviously this is way more expensive but we wanted to take pictures and stuff like that so we thought this would be a better option With our boat ride, um, so we just realized that two six four zero is for eight people, up to eight six, people. Six to eight people. Six to eight people. So if there were eight people going, like a full group, it would be essentially like three thirty rupees. But is, this is only for the luxury boat. If you are a group of eight or more, they generally suggest the ten seater boat for you. Okay, so it will be even cheaper yeah. then. So it was just the two of us. So obviously, thoda mehenga pada, but I think it was nice. I just wish अगर 40 minutes होता ना तो पैसा एकदम ही वसूल लगता बट ऑब्वियसली सिर्फ हम दोनों थे हमें मास्क उतार के फोटोज लेने थे तो कोविड के वजह से भी ऑप्टेड फॉर द प्राइवेट बोर्ड अदरवाइज वी ऑल्सो वुड हैव गॉन इन द पब्लिक बोर्ड ओनली बट एनी वे नाउ वेर गोइंग टू करनी माता रोक वे बट इट्स अगेन थंडरिंग सो आई एम डिड यू हर दैट इट्स थंडरिंग इवन नाउ सो आई एम जस्ट वॉरेड दैट इट माइट स्टार्ट रेनिंग एंड I don't know. I'm just a little bit scared about going in the ropeway while it's like raining and pouring. Also, we got a butta, so just gonna enjoy that in the rickshaw now. So we have reached the Karni Mata ropeway and we have taken the tickets. It is 117 per person to and fro. 
देर इज ऑल्सो ऑप्शन फॉर पर्सनल फैमिली केबिन कपल केबिन एक्सेट्रा एंड देर इज ऑल्सो थ्री डी आर्ट गैलरी दैट यू कैन ऑप्ट फॉर बाई पेइंग लिटल एक्स्ट्रा आई थिंक दैट्स टू हंड्रेड रुपीज पर टिकट उसके रिव्यूज अच्छे नहीं है हाँ सो उसके रिव्यूज इतने अच्छे नहीं थे सो वी डेंट टेक दर वी जस्ट टू द हंड्रेड एंड सेवेंटी रुपीज का टिकट एंड नाव यू आर वेटिंग इन लाइन फॉर आर टर्न guess where we are we're back at our hotel um so the ropeway was amazing it was actually really nice uh, way more than what i expected the ropeway actual ropeway jo tha usme kuch zyada tha nahi it was very quick like a 5 minute thing wo bhi zyada bol rahi hu main but upar jaake jo view tha was so pretty like it was such a beautiful sunset um anyway we have actually been um sitting here in our hotel for i think almost 2 hours anyway evenings are like reserved for work pura din jo kaam nahi kar paya that we are like catching up on right now so i think that's what we're going to do i feel like for half an hour or to mujhe lagne hi wala hai so i'm doing my own thing at this doing his own thing and uh, raat ka plan hai to go to rainbow cafe which is a cafe literally like 10 steps away from our hotel and it's actually quite a famous cafe um this afternoon we did go and check out their menu it looked really nice and the place also looked really nice so that's what we're going to do for dinner so actually for dinner we try to like stay in our area that's what we're going to do ahead also because raat ko coming back alone just the two of us i personally feel very unsafe so the fact that it's literally next to our hotel makes me like feel comfortable even if we end up coming a little bit late raat ko back this is our spot this is where we've been chilling for a while and check out the view i don't think i've showed you guys what the hotel looks like at night so literally every corner is just stunning so we made it to rainbow cafe and and um, looks very pretty raat ke time pe they put like little uh, candles on each table so it's like really pretty like yellow lit and samne ka view is also very beautiful let me try and show you what it looks like i can't promise ki waisa hi dikhega real life mein kyunki raat ko thoda capture karna you know difficult ho jata hai so it's a rooftop cafe and looks beautiful aur ye hai view kafi similar hai hamare hotel se because it's literally Two minutes away. Two minutes भी नहीं यार twenty seconds away. Food is here, so I've ordered um, Arabiata penne pasta, and then Aditya's ordered uh, chicken lasagna. Looks actually really good. Let's try it. Smells good. Nice. Very good. It's good. Really. It's the next day, and I just want to come on here and end today's vlog, part one of our Udaipur trip. Yesterday was amazing, Rainbow Cafe. Definitely visit. The food was great, the vibe was great, the location was great. So overall, a really really good experience. Part two is coming really soon, and it's going to be an exciting challenge almost. So stay tuned, and I'll see you soon in my next video. Bye.